Today I'm just going to be discussing why does BH Gate take so long to ship out their shoes and why do they take so long to come in the mail. Okay, so I wrote down some notes to um, go over with you guys. So I wrote down five, five things on why DH Gate takes so long to ship out your shoes and why they take so long to come. So number one is the pandemic. The pandemic is going on, still going on. In in China, they have short air supply. So from the US to China, um, I guess when US airplanes get to China, um, you know, it's short air supply. They, they can only take so much on the airplane. And the fact that they're limited on the airplanes going to China, from the U, US going to China, um, you know, they're taking a, it's, it's limited because of the pandemic and, you know, there's short air supply. So because of the pandemic, you're waiting like three to four weeks to get your shoes in the mail due to that reason. And yeah, they can't fit a lot of um, packages on the airplane. So the air supply is really, um, very limited. I don't know why they're sending over uh, less amount of airplanes to China to pick up packages to ship back over to the US. I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure it's due to the pandemic and you know, for less, less um, it's spreading, the um, coronavirus spreading. I guess, the, I guess the US sends over limited airplanes to pick up packages from China. And plus, and plus, China is where the pandemic started anyway. So, yeah. So, on to number two we have here. It's pretty much based on the seller. So, when you order shoes, there's different sellers on DHgate that sell shoes. So, it's multiple sellers. So, based on the seller, if they um, don't have your size already in their shop or, you know... Um, if it's taking too long for them to like sh uh, process it and, and ship it out, they pretty much have to order it. They have to order it to their store or either the company that they, the shop buys from has to make the shoe in your size. So pretty much if the seller don't have your size or the color that you want that you pick in shoes, they pretty much have to wait to um, get your shoe size or the color or whatever shoe you pick because they probably don't have it in their store. So that's one of the, so that's the second reason why um, the seller is taking a long time to process your items because they either don't have the color or your shoe size or, or they have to wait to buy it from a different seller or wait for the company to make it. So that goes for number two on why, you know, it's taking the order to post and you could um, track it. It's because it's one of these reasons. Now on all these um, questions, all of these things happened to me. So this happened to me before, you know, I messaged the seller and they say, no, we don't have, we, we didn't have your size, shoe size in, in my shop. So I have to wait for your size to come in because I had to order it. And yeah, it was communication back and forth with the seller. So um, if you feel like messaging the seller on why you don't see your item or your order um, up there yet to track, it's because of num this reason, number two reason. 
they don't have your size they gotta uh, order it number three okay so number three is because probably because you keep bugging you keep bugging and messaging the seller constantly a lot of people do that I understand that it's in China and you feel like you don't trust China in the beginning I didn't trust China either I mean it's a foreign country you're sending you know not a lot of money but a decent amount of money and you want your items but it's also not right to keep on bugging and constantly messaging the seller um, asking them have you shipped my order yet what's taking so long for you to ship it um, you know why is it the tracking number working why is my stuff still in transit why hasn't it why don't I see that it's moving you know moving up you know coming to the United States blah 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 so my advice to you is don't keep messaging the seller because they have a bunch of orders that they have to um, process and it's not because they're you know trying to scam you or anything it's just because it's China and a lot of people order on DH gate so constantly messaging and bugging the seller will only make your order take longer and they do that on purpose because it happened to me there's a time where I kept messaging the seller and bugging them you know why don't I why don't I see that my order ship why is it still in transit they they will say either they won't message you back or they'll be like my friend you have to wait you must have patience they will do that in China you really have to respect I don't know they have like a respect policy if you keep bugging them and not don't have patience they will put your order last they will make you wait longer trust me it's happened to me and yeah so if you're wondering why your order is taking so long to be shipped you're either constantly bugging them or constantly messaging them when will my order ship? When will my order ship? They will do that on purpose. They will, they will um, post your order for like a long time, all because you keep bugging them. So the longer you, the more you keep messaging them and constantly bugging them, the longer they will uh, post your item or ship out your item. Okay, so on to number four. Your item says ship, but the tracking says still in transit. I get this a lot the seller will mark your item as shipped but when you track it with the tracking number it says still in transit it could say still in transit for like a week or two and you're probably sitting there wondering why is it still in transit why is it not moving why it's taking so long you know for the process and you don't see it like moving out of the China area into the United States area okay let's go over why is doing that so number a they probably created a tracking number but didn't really ship your shoes so yeah number a they probably created a tracking number but didn't ship your shoes so I don't really know why they do this but a lot of sellers do this on DH gate they mark your stuff as shipped but then when you track it, it says still in transit. Okay, so if you're seeing this, if you see, if you're having this problem right now on DHgate, I suggest you just message the message the seller because your stuff shouldn't be in transit more than two weeks. I would give it about two weeks to be in transit. The third week, if it's still saying in transit obviously there's something wrong either the seller don't didn't have the shoe you wanted the size you wanted or the color you wanted so they don't want to message you and tell you you know look here we don't have your shoe size um i'm going to give you a refund they don't like giving refunds so they'll just mark it as ship and your stuff will just be sitting in transit for a long time so on the third week i suggest just messaging the seller and be like hey you know why my stuff haven't shipped yet is still in transit. If the seller do not message you back, I might as well go, I mean, you might as well go ahead and open up a dispute on that seller's page because obviously they're trying to scam you. RB, 
they could have your shoes sitting in the post office there in China is really slow. So that's another reason. Number B, they could have your shoes sitting in the post office, which means they shipped out your item, but the post office in China are taking really slow because maybe they're backed up on a lot of orders from DH gate. And that could be another reason why your shoes are sitting in transit for so long because the post office there um, is really slow or either really backed up with orders so they haven't got to your package or order yet to um, go through the system. So that's number B on why your shoes could be just sitting in transit. Number C, if the shoes are in transit for two weeks, it could be a scam, especially if the seller is not messaging you back. Like I just said, you know, if it's more than two weeks, if it's on to the third week and your stuff is still sitting in transit, I suggest just messaging the seller. And if they don't message you back, I just recommend opening up the dispute on their page. On to number five. Okay, so on to number five. They are going by order. A lot of people could have ordered a lot of shoes, so there could be orders before yours. Pretty much your order is waiting in line to be processed. So if you order some shoes on DHgate and it's still not saying, you know, has been shipped and on the on on your order is saying it's still being processed, it's still being processed because a lot of people, well, the particular seller that you order from, a lot of people could have ordered shoes before you. So the seller is pretty much going based on <clears throat> based on um, the order it was received. So you could have ordered shoes and you could be like the 10th person in line and you got five other people are, you know, nine other people ahead of you that order shoes. So pretty much the seller is going by order is going based on order. Some sellers do this. So if you, they have like 20 orders that people just ordered, uh, some sellers go by, you know, in line. So pretty much you're waiting in line. That seller has you waiting in line because they like doing it in order, the order they receive. So you got the first person, the second person, and then yours could be last. So that's probably another reason why you're seeing your um, your order is still being processed because of this situation. The seller is, you know, going by order in the uh, first, the first come, you know, the first people to get in out and then you could be the last. So that's probably one of the reasons why your order is still saying, still in process. <clears throat> so that was the end of my, um, my personal, you know, review on why DHgate takes so long to ship out your stuff or you take it a long time to receive it. It's because of these um, questions here on my review, on my expectations, because all of these expectations came, I mean, <clears throat> happened to me. So all of this happened to me. So I'm like a pro at DHgate, like, I know everything like I know who to order from I know who to not order from so yeah so just take my advice when it comes to on why you know your order is being um, processed and why it's taking so long it's because of one of these um, definitions that I wrote down so yeah like I said don't keep messaging the seller or they will put you last um, like I said, if it's more than three weeks, your stuff is still in transit, message the seller. And if they don't message back, open up this dispute, you know, short air supply because of the pandemic. So you're waiting like three to four weeks to get your shoes. And yeah, you know, it says ship, but the tracking says still in transit. I get to, you know, it's because of the, uh, post office there. The post office there is backed up on a lot of orders so that could be why you know your shoes your items is taking so long because of the post office there 
it's taken a long time to process all of the other orders that are there at the post office. Okay, so this wraps up the video today on why your orders are taking so long on dhgate.com. I hope you guys um, take heed to my word and my advice with these definitions on why. Um, stay tuned for another video on how I show you who to order from and who not to order from because you might get scammed. So I might make a video of that and just um, show you guys a screen recording on how I order from DHgate just to give you guys some advice from ordering from there. And yeah, so thanks for watching this video today. Stay tuned for that video coming out soon. And yeah, thanks for watching this video today. I gotta go. Peace.